Hey guys, it's Kevin here, and today I'm here to give you another exciting uh, review about um, floor cleaning uh, robots. Um, if you're new to my channel, I review all kinds of products, so please do uh, hit that like button and subscribe. Uh, feel free also to comment below, I usually do respond. Um, so today's product is um, the PowerBot R7040 by Samsung. Um, I previously had a floor cleaning robot and I had some problems with it. It was constantly having battery issues and it would randomly beep, especially it seems like in the middle of the night and it would wake us up. So um, I was, figured it was time to get a replacement. And, and there's a lot more options on the market today. And I came across Samsung, which um, controls with my phone and it now controls with um, Alexa, so you can tell her to, va to vacuum. And I figured, you know, let's let's give this one a try versus the other brand. Um, if you don't have one of these, this is an investment because these things are over, um, any good one is definitely over $100, $150. Um, they will completely change your life. It is so nice not having to vacuum and always having clean floors, especially if you have pets. Um, you just set it to, you can set it by schedule. Um, so that way, like my old one, I used to schedule a run every other day. Uh, otherwise, you can spot clean with it. Um, you can just regularly, whenever you feel like the house is dirty, you can uh, hit, hit the play button and it'll it'll go and do its thing. Um, it is so nice having clean floors. So it is totally worth it. You will never have to vacuum again, which is just incredible. So, all right, let me go on. What do you get out of if you end up buying this? Um, so this model, the R740, is one of the lower models. They have all kinds of models, um, depending on your needs. Uh, with more performance, if you have more pets, uh, longer battery life, um, more controlling features. So I'll include a link down below, so that way you can kind of see all the various um, options. But for the most part, you get this is everything you get if you buy the Samsung um, PowerBot. So, it comes with the base station, pretty straightforward. You got the brick, you plug it into an outlet, um, just pick a good spot so where the robot will be, it'll be its home. Um, make sure you do have some good clearance on either side so it can navigate its way back home. So this is the power station. Um, this one comes with the remote, and from the remote you can see it can spot clean, it's got sound, repeat, schedule, clock, um, different types of cleaning modes, but once again, um, Samsung has an app um, that I recommend using because from the app, it's easy to set in and program the, the days you want it to clean, spot clean. You can even drive the thing up through their app. And then another feature, which you can kind of see on their box here, they have a little map. So it kind of shows you everywhere um, the robot has clean. Like, so we noticed the, the lip into our bathroom is too tall, so it can't get over that. And so it doesn't, never cleans the bathroom. But um, the app is definitely definitely the way to go. So the robot itself, um, this is what it basically looks like. Um, on the underside here, you've got the wheels. Um, this is the, the brush, which is really easy to clean. You just push down the yellow tabs, and then this is a magnet pops out. This pops out, so you can, every few cleans, I highly recommend cutting out little hair if you get long hair on and off button, and this is the battery compartment. The sensors are all built here in the front. Um, if there's places you don't want it to go, they make these magnetic strips that you can put down on the ground that will keep it from going there. I've had no problems after using it of it getting stuck between furniture, which is awesome. Um, the old one I had sometimes would do that. It would get stuck and then just start beeping and we'd have to go rescue it. Uh, at the front here, um, you can also, this is its camera um, that helps determine where it's going. And then you have onboard controls, but once again, you should never have to touch those once you do your setup, because I would, once again, use the app. Um, as far as cleaning the tray, super easy. There's a push button. Here's the tray itself. Um, it holds a good amount. Uh, you need to clean it after every use. Um, my house is 1,600 uh, square feet, and it takes... Uh, two charges um, to clean it, and it fills the bin when I run it every other day. So um, that kind of, you'll have to play with it to kind of figure out what fits best with your house. Um, pop this open. It has a um, washable filter, which this is another big plus for Samsung. Um, 
The other model that I had had a um, regular filter that you'd have to replace every few months. So you just, once you buy it, you're spending more money, and then of course you can only get it from them, and that kind of stuff. So this was a big perk. Just make sure it's completely dry before putting it in. And then here's the little fan unit. So you just pull this out, and then you empty your tray out. So real easy, like I said, to clean. Um, I've been really impressed with it. Um, it will change your life. Like I said, if, if you're new to robots or you're, you're thinking about um, getting one, I, I highly recommend you checking out Samsung's. Um, after using it, it, it kind of maps out the room. Um, I know there's other robots that just kind of bounce around until it fully covers. Um, so it's pretty efficient. And like I said, it, it can do my whole house in a couple hours and uh, I've, I've been very happy with it. So uh, if you have any questions or comments, like I said, feel free to comment down below um, and then I'll include a link so you can check out other reviews and find other information. So until the next review, you guys take it easy. Later. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. I hope you liked it. Be sure to help me out and uh, hit the subscribe button or comment below on this video. Until the next one, be sure to check out any of the other videos that I have floating around on my channel.